when I first started this, this, this long road of basketball, knowledge and education, what consumed me was being the best basketball player I could be. tonight the story concerning Michael Jordan's physical conditions this Jordan arriving about two hours ago he is suffering from flu-like symptoms made his way out of the court just moments ago never any doubt around the stretch how I mean how weak were you I was really tired I was very weak at halftime I told uh, Phil that use me in you know, spurts but I mean somehow I found the energy just stay strong. I wanted it really bad. All right, congratulations on a great game, Michael. Get some rest, Thanks. and we'll see you on Friday. I don't know if Michael can carry the ball on the road. Everything clicking right now for Utah. Against Russell to the free throw line. Hangs in the air, tougher good. Oh, shot. Nothing but net for Michael. And the steal up by Jordan. Oh, oh, the back on Russell. He turned it around and finished the pivot. Oh, by Jordan. What a play by Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan continues to blaze away. Illness or not. Bad pass, lost the handle. Here's Jordan, comes down on Hunter's that goes to the glass. Right play up for Michael. A heroic performance by Michael Jordan. Yeah, you know, it's all about desire. You just got to come out here and do what you got to do. And as for Michael Jordan, all the superlatives have been exhausted and almost all applied. His essence is so much deeper than image. His heart and his athletic integrity, every bit as impressive as his artistry. The game of basketball has been everything to me. My refuge, my place I've always gone when I needed to find comfort and peace. It's been a source of intense pain, a source of most intense feelings of joy and satisfaction, and one that no one can even imagine. It's been a relationship that has evolved over time and has given me the greatest respect and love for the game. I didn't want to give up. No matter how sick I was, how tired I was, I felt the obligation to my team to get to Chicago to go out and give that extra effort. Michael just laboring to get back to that defensive end, just trying to get to the finish line. Jordan looks in over Russell, facing the basket, keeps it over the top of the end. Yeah! Sweat just pouring off Michael Jordan. No time to rest now. Demanded the ball. Back Michael. Open three. Yeah! They lead it. 38 points for the king. A courageous, classic performance by the fluid Michael Jordan. It's a kind of magic It's a kind of magic A kind of magic One dream One soul One prize One goal One golden glance Of what should be It's a kind of magic One shot He's got it all. He's got the mental and, and physical abilities, and he has the uh, the innate qualities of a of a world class player.
sometime I really think it's a dream. And I'm just going to wake up tomorrow and, and then none of this is going to happen. My own expectations are just to go in and try to contribute, you know, and uh, don't try to do anything out of the ordinary. off on me one time he took off so quick and he was up so high he was just walking in the air bam be a big asset for me and uh, you know, I guess being able to create things with that wild mind that I have. Where he's going to take off on this dunk. Why? Just now hopefully I can make a name for myself. I think Michael Jordan sounds pretty good to me. First NBA All-Star appearance, the 6'6 rookie from the Chicago Bulls, Michael Jordan. He can jump and I'm slow and I can't jump, so I don't think I've ever seen him bike that long like he does. He'll really take away his jumping ability, he can still be a great basketball player. Perhaps you can turn that Bulls thing around. What do you think? Hopefully, uh, I can go in and contribute and maybe turn it around. Uh, you know, I'm looking forward to that. That's one of the few guys that I would pay to watch play. I think he's the most outstanding player in the game. There's just nobody like him. He's, he's, he's good. He's awful. The best basketball player that I've ever seen play. And I think the remarkable thing about him is that I'm not sure people really know how good this guy is. You can fly, can you? For a little while. Mission control ready for launch. Chicago Stadium. 34 
for Jordan. Michael Evans drive inside, scoops it in. 50. Drive in the lane, shoots under pressure. Go to the foul call. That's 61 for Jordan. on and all of a sudden the ball the game is his and he'll go on a tear that usually isn't seen in this late very often here's michael at the foul line a shot on elo guys the bulls win they win michael you stuck it baby you stuck it yeah yeah set the vcr's man once he goes that's the only thing you're gonna have and michael jordan feels it and it's gonna be awfully tough to slow him down right now jordan on the pass this will be good! 69 points for Michael Jordan. Oh yeah! Showtime for the Bullies! That's a dunk like I've never seen in this game! <laughs> Pitch set the pick. Jordan lost. Kenny Johnson and Lambeer just fired at Jordan. Michael doesn't like it. Very physical foul. Lambeer using the left arm to throw Michael down. Stepping in. Stay on top, first of all. He's going to get the ball on top. When he gets it, he wants the drive right. He wants the drive right. The Jordan rules. Is that something you guys made up? the paper and they would talk about how you know we try to hurt people Have you ever been afraid on the court ever against Never. anybody? Never. Have you ever been intimidated by anybody? Never. I mean, these guys put on their shorts just like me. 
I don't, see, I don't see anyone on the basketball court. The only thing I can see that's a, a weakness to Michael Jordan is the fact that uh, if he shows up and he just don't want to play and then only score 30 and start a 50. Other players who are all-star caliber uh, have a lot of courage also. Uh, you can see their courage go away when they're playing against him. He emotionally and mentally destroys players at times, and you can see it happen. <laughs> defensive player in the league in my opinion he's the best competitor in the league in my opinion he's by far the best offensive player in, in my opinion he's the best clutch player in the game he's got the whole package and his skill level on top of that enormous physical package really sets him apart from the other players Came down the lane, he just, you know, went one way, put it in one hand, throwed it up five more yards, said, well, I don't know. Oh, a spectacular move by Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan taking off for the deuce. And the Chicago Bulls have won their first ever NBA championship. question whether Michael Jordan was willing to give up the sacrifice for a championship was completely wrong. Jordan is such a great winner, such a great competitor and wanted so badly. And Michael Jordan continues his onslaught. And Michael looks over at us and said, he can't guard me. He feels it. There's nothing else he can say other than the man feels it and lets us know. Oh, my God. 
and the worldwide leader in sports. This is ESPN News. Last night, we began the show with the disappearance of Michael Jordan's father. Tonight, the worst fears have come Good day. Through. We're coming on the air now with word that the body of James Jordan, the father of Chicago Bulls basketball star Michael Jordan, has been found in a creek near the border between South and North Carolina. The world's greatest basketball player and expected and will announce his retirement tomorrow. Sources with the Chicago Bulls have confirmed that Michael Jordan will announce his retirement effective immediately. The greatest basketball player who's ever played the game has apparently hung it up for good. That's the news that's making headlines across the country this morning. Michael Jordan, the best player in the country's hottest sport, the most recognizable athlete in all the world, that's apparently decided to call it quits at the age of 30. The world's most recognizable athlete, so despondent over the death of his father, has decided to call it quits. I'm never complacent with what I've achieved. You know, I never feel that I'm at my best. I feel I still have room to improve. I still set goals for myself to strive for. I still feel that I have a plateau that you know, I hadn't reached yet. When I get to a point where I feel I can improve as a player, I walk away from the game. Michael Jordan marched into the Bulls' practice facility Wednesday morning to announce his retirement. Teammates flanked him and coaches stood by, along with hundreds of assembled media with one collective question. Why? When I lose uh, the sense of motivation and the sense of to prove something as a basketball player, uh, it's time for me to move away from the game of basketball. I'd say when I walk away from the game, I won't miss the cheers because it was there. It was there. I can remember those things, but I don't need it to live. I don't need it to survive. Uh, and that was, that's, that's very important to me. Michael Jordan is going to give baseball a shot. The word retire means you can do anything you want from this day on. So if I desire to come back and play again, maybe that's what I want to do. Maybe that's the challenge that I may need someday down the road. You know, I can't do the things that I used to do. If, if so, I wouldn't have came back. I love it because I know I still can do those things. That's the reason I'm back. I'm not here to, to give you a second-rate, you know, a cameo appearance. You know, I came back here to do the job, the top job that I, I, was, you know, I always have done. Yeah. Hopefully I can redeem myself to what happened last year. 
It's all over and the Bulls season comes to an end. Here at the United Center in the Orlando Magic, the number one team, the number one seed in the East, gets the victory with 14 straight points. Michael Jordan gets down low. I don't care who's playing him. He's almost impossible one-on-one to stop. Vintage Michael. Jordan is being the best Michael Jordan right now. And the sheer will to win and, and the unflappable, unshakable confidence and arrogance about it. Michael Jordan does the things that we all just dream about. Here's a, a person who, through hard work and perseverance, is able to act out all of our dreams. Right here, Jordan's telling it right there. You better get out of my face, rookie. Michael Jordan. I expect myself to make those shots. You guys have seen it so often, you expect me to do it. You know, so that's part of the motivation. That's part of the challenge, is to go out there and make it happen, because everyone expects it. Are you the best to ever play this game? I like to think that I was the best. When I leave this game, I like to think that I was the best to ever play in the 15 years that I played. Jordan driving. Beautiful move. Oh. oh. And he is screaming at Jeff Van Gundy. Michael, you still set the standard for greatness, determination, and leadership. Congratulations, 1995-96 NBA Most Valuable Player. Yeah, I, I feel like I'm the most fierce competitor there is. I don't think I'm ever going to find something to equal the game of basketball for me. You know, basketball is my love, I always have been. I can't ever envision an ending of something like that until I'm dead and gone. I felt compelled each and every day to go out and take it an extra mile. There's something compelling about this guy, so likable, so beautiful to watch, and yet with the athletic heart of an assassin and just look right through you. Myself. Because a lot of times I had to battle with myself to keep challenging myself. When you get to a certain pinnacle, you gotta find some ways to keep going out there for 82 games. I have the greatest respect for Michael because he put his heart and soul on the court every night. You know, just watching him dribble up that court and looking you right in the eye and not knowing what he's gonna do is the scariest thing you ever want to be involved in. But when he came on the floor, people knew that they were in trouble. maxing out my education about the game of basketball. Physically, I think I am, but mentally, there's a lot of empty space that I don't know much about. The Chicago Bulls have regained the NBA throne, and for Michael Jordan, the king returns. An emotional moment for Michael Jordan. I know he's watching. This is my daddy. I'm very happy for you. The will that 
that Michael brought to the game, the sheer energy, we're not going to lose no matter what. Whatever you paid to see Michael Jordan it wasn't enough. You knew that every night out there you were going to get the greatest concert of your life. Wham! In your face! Shook him with the hop step, rise, oh, 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 man. I think it's very interesting. I want to know those people that have enough moxie to go out and bet against Michael Jordan. The way he plays, he will not let the Bulls lose. MJ, top of the circle against Russell. Michael hangs, fires. from flu-like symptoms, uh, his status is uncertain. People don't understand, it's not his jumping, or his jump shot, or his defense. It's his inner guts and his inner heart. You're gonna have to cut Michael Jordan's heart out to beat him. Here's Jordan, comes down on Harness, that goes to the glass, driving layup for Michael. A heroic performance by Michael Jordan. to baseball or anything to that nature. From the moment he set foot on an NBA court, Michael Jordan dominated his sport like few athletes ever had. He electrified crowds with his skill and style. He turned the Chicago Bulls into a dynasty with six championships in eight years. And in 15 seasons with the Bulls and Wizards, he would transcend the game of basketball, becoming one of the most recognizable athletes in the world. Not bad for a player who was once cut from his high school team. To me, he's, he's the greatest of all time. I wanted to be like him. I wore the same number as him. I wanted to wear my uniform like him. When you think of Michael Jordan, he's just, just that competitive fire. You, you just shook your head. We were playing as hard as we could, and he went to a whole nother level. You know, homicidally competitive. His entire life just revolved around beating other people. He is the definition of somebody so good at what they do. People have been talking about comparisons with Michael Jordan for years. Are you talking about the greatest that ever played a game? Yeah, I want to be compared with Michael Jordan. You know, don't be in a rush to try to find the next Michael Jordan. It's not going to be another Michael Jordan. Michael at the foul line, a shot on Elo. Good! The Bulls win! He goes in straight.
Kincaid goes up in the air. Now he's sideways. Look at the air. Look at the hang time. Look at the flying motion. Cause it's a bittersweet symphony that's One day you might look up and see me playing a game of 50. Oh, don't laugh. Not that. You never say never, because limits, like fears, are often just an illusion. Thank you very much. Michael Jordan was everything. Everybody's hero. That guy's got a lot of heart. I was just so in awe. He changed my life. Once in a lifetime. He's the greatest of all time.